Hi darlings, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you are all doing extremely well. So today's video is going to be a review, unboxing and comparison of the Tory Burch sandals. So I've got two sandals from Tory Burch. Um, I've got the Tory Burch Mini Miller sandals. I think those are the cheapest ones. Those are the ones that are made from like the jelly-like material. And then I also have the Metal Miller sandals. So those ones are the ones that have like the metal um, logo on the sandal. So I will pop two pictures here just to show you guys, um, just in case you guys don't understand what I'm saying. I actually went into the Terry Butch store to pick them out. Unfortunately, they didn't have my size, so I did pick out one of them and the other one was shipped out to me in this box. So I'm going to be doing a comparison of what you get when you go into the store and what you get if you order it online from the Terry Butch website because this was placed um, online for me and I received the order in about two three days. So anyway, enough talk. Uh, this intro is so long So let's just jump right to it. All right So I'm gonna start off with the minis which I have here I am so in love with the packaging of Tory Burch. I mean look at how this bag looks like I absolutely love this bag um, Obviously Tory Burch is a contemporary designer and so I guess that reflects in her packaging. You can see the beautiful color. I love this lemon green. Oh, everything just looks so good. But anyway, let me pop it out of the box. This is how the box looks. Um, I got mine in a size US 11. So I will talk about sizing, um, but first of all, let me just show you the unboxing and let me show you how everything looks. These look so good, guys. So when you unbox them, this is what you get. I got mine in a white color and oh my God. So FYI, I didn't plan to get these. I actually went in the store to get the um, metal millers and I saw this beautiful lady beside me trying these on and it looked so good on her. And I was like, do you have my size? And they did. So the rest is history. Anyway, so these retail, um, let me show you how much they retail. So they do give you this lovely pouch in there and your receipt is in there. So these retail for I think about $98. Yes, they retail for $98 and with tax everything came to about $105 for the mini sandals which are these ones. So you can see the Terry Birch logo. This obviously is made in like a jelly material. Um, it's in like this really flexible, like rubber like material. I got mine in white. They have other colors, but I absolutely loved it. Oh, just look at the logo. Look at how that looks guys. It does have a Terry Birch logo. I don't know if you can see here. It does have the Terry Birch logo imprinted on the foot of the sole. There isn't any other logo at all. So just in case you're wanting to know how it looks, in case you want to know if it's a fake or not. Um, yeah, the only imprint you're going to get is on the foot here. I guess because it's rubber, they really can't put an imprint anywhere else. So that is it for how it looks. So let's open the metal miller sandals i didn't show you guys the packaging of this one like the dust bag and all of that because i'm going to show it to you in this one and it would just be repetitive so yeah <laughs> so this is how it came so the metal miller sandals came in this like pink box i'm going to show you guys the difference i don't know if that's how it is but that's how mine came. So it came in this like cute pink box while the minis came in like a smaller box. You can see this box is smaller. Um, and they did also give me like the bag, even though I didn't go into, into the store, this was actually packaged in there for me, which I thought was a nice touch because most times like they don't actually give you this if you don't go into the store, but this was actually put in the package for me, which I thought was really nice. So let's, let's just jump into the unboxing. So I'm going to pop this open. So when you pop it open, this is how it comes. And this is a duffel bag. I didn't show you in the other one because it would just be repetitive. So I'm going to show you how it looks. So every um, original Tory Burch bag comes with these duffel bags. Um, yeah, so this is how the duffel bag looks. It doesn't have any logo imprinted on it, but it does have like the Tory Burch charm show you guys so you can see the charm there and obviously you can pull that and you're supposed to store everything in there so i thought this was a nice touch so when you do get it this is how it looks and <gasps> i love these sandals oh my god 
god, this is how they look. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh. So this is how it looks. I got mine in like the black and gold color. Oh my God, so beautiful. So I'm gonna show you guys the difference between the two. So this, this is the Metal Miller and this is the mini ones. And you can, as you can see, um, not only is this made of rubber, this is made of like pure leather, but you can see like the logo here is a lot smaller. Let me bring it closer so you can see like, this is like a mini logo of the Tory Burch. This, this is smaller. Whilst the Metal Miller, you can see it's like a bigger logo. Can you see? And in terms of what you get in the writing, you do have Tory Burch imprinted right here. And also, if it is an original Tory Burch, it should say made in Brazil. Inside, inside of the shoe, you, I can't show you guys, but inside should say made in Brazil. And then on the other side, it should have like the serial number of the shoe. Um, I think that's all you're going to get, like the Tory Burch printed here. And then you have made in Brazil and then the serial number. There is also Tory Burch at this side of the shoe as well. I was scared that I had to go up a size, but I didn't go up a size. And I will show you guys how it looks. So I also do get like a card where obviously your receipt is in and I'm going to tell you guys how much I paid. So the Metal Miller sandals actually retail for $228. Yeah, $228. I ended up paying $243. Okay, $243 with tax. That's how much everything came up to. So these sandals are not cheap. Okay, so all in all, I spent around about 250 for these and 100 for the other one. So about $350 was how much I spent. Um, and I justified that by saying that I was going to buy the $600 Gucci ones anyway, huh? And now I've saved half the money. So I was happy. I was a happy girl. <laughs> okay. So which one do I prefer? What do I think you should, where do I think you should spend your money? Honestly, I like both of them. I feel like they serve different purposes. But honestly, I thought that these sandals were going to be just for like uh, going to the beach and things like that, but they do look really stylish. Like I have found myself like styling outfits with these ones. So I'm definitely thinking of getting a different color in this one. Like it looks so cute when you put it on. These I highly recommend. Like these jazz up any outfit guys, like any outfit. This jazzes it up, makes it look so cute. Oh my God, like, I'm ugh, dead, finished. You can be trying to look simple and plain. These, they just take it up a notch. These look gorgeous. All right, darling, so that's my video for the day. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, do let me know by leaving me a comment in the comment section. Also, let me know what your favorite was. Which one did you prefer? Did you prefer the mini Millers, like the jelly ones, or did you prefer like the leather sandals? Let me know in the comment section what your opinion is. Thank you so much for watching and hopefully I will see you in my next video.